Hi, I'm Steve Phillips from the Pengrove Power and Implement Museum. Behind me is one of our treasures that we have acquired. It's a Pratt Whitney 4360 aircraft engine. I've wanted one of these engines since I knew what a 28 cylinder corn cob was. This is a very large cubic inch engine. It's 4,000 cubic inches and it develops, this particular engine develops 3,000 horsepower and we acquired this a couple of years ago now from the Western Museum of Flight in Ontario and when we got it it was in a can which is a shipping container that they ship, the military ships them in. We believe this engine came from Howard Hughes's Spruce Goose. We also believe that it was used when the aircraft, it was in use when the aircraft flew originally and we brought it here and started toiling the many hours of labor to figure out what made it work and what we needed to make it run and we've accomplished that. The engine runs very well. Uh, we cut down a prop and put on the front so we got it for cooling and also for a little drag it doesn't offer much. The engine is really a crowd pleaser, it's very very loud and we have 28 exhaust stacks on it and they all crackle and snap like you're at the drags where the drags are in your running. The engine burns about a gallon of fuel a minute at what we run it at which is basically no throttle. We have been running it on 100 octane low lead. The military specs is 150 octane fuel, which kind of out of our price range. But like I say, it's, it's quite a crowd pleaser. It's probably the most complicated engine that anyone ever wanted to run onto as far as a hand-built engine, no computers, just slide rolls and doing it the hard way. And it's, it's truly a work of art.